should be live. Actually, I forgot to grab my phone from where it was charging while I was getting this all ready. Uh, I'm just going to say this. The thing that was giving me issues disappeared. Uh, <laughs> basically, it was, it was there was an overlay for uh, the GeForce Experience, which I just recently reinstalled because I found out that for some reason I didn't have it anymore, which meant my drivers weren't updating, um, which isn't ideal. So I, I went and got the GeForce Experience, and it, it, there's an overlay thing that it automatically does where over a game you'll see like a little microphone and like a little circle arrow refreshy symbol thing. Uh, and, you know, that just kind of gets in the way of stuff, so I didn't like it. And I wanted to get rid of it, so I went to open the GeForce Experience uh, to do that. And because I had just downloaded, or because previously I had downloaded and installed as much as I could the updates to my drivers, it was refusing to let me uh, open the experience because it needed to restart my computer to install its drivers. So I did that. Uh, and, uh, they still have not shown up. Uh, that said, uh, if they do have it show up, oh, wait, is this it? Oh my god, the GeForce Experience is showing up now. It's able to install the thing it needed. Wow. <laughs> All right, so that's happening now, uh, which means it'll probably have the things pop up in a minute, but I might also be able to, in a minute, uh, remove that overlay that I don't like, because it's distracting and annoying. Uh, I also was downloading the Rapid Ash and Bayonet sprites, and they have, they have magically appeared for me. Uh, where is the Bayonet? Ah, oh, the Bayonet one opened a second, a second GIMP. Uh, I hate when that happens. Alright. Eh. Alright. Not 1280. And get off insert mode. Thank you. 12. Alright, 128. There we go. Yeah, I was just getting these sprites because it's not like they're going to evolve today, but I want to have it ready. Oh, uh, GeForce Experience, finish updating so that I can remove your overlay before it shows up. That would be wonderful. I'll just continue the starting of the stream. So, <clears throat> basically, um, I've actually been trying to see if I can remove this lag. Uh, there's an option I have here, which is changing the render method. And I'm going to test what happens if I change it to a different one, if it lags a little less. Because it still lags, I know that. But, see, it's not doing it as much, I, I feel. Like, I feel like this is definitely more bearable, right? Like, it's still going to happen sometimes. Uh, but also, I'm what I'm doing right now is I'm basically trying to get... Yeah, see, here's the lag hitting. Oh, the GeForce experience is opening. I can change the thing. Oh, wonderful. Uh, I should actually be able... Yeah, I can still control things with my controller, I found out, while I'm doing stuff. All right, settings. Oh, my God, I can do this. Where is it? In-game overlay. Turned off. Thank you. Oh. Perfect. Okay. So, like, you can hear the lag setting right now, but not quite the same as it was. But we have to go through here to get to Flash, so that's why I'm going through here. To get to Flash. Uh, Alright. Sarmies are in Diglett's tunnel, or whatever it is. Diglett tunnel. Diglett cave. Cave o' Diglett. Alright, Starmie. You, you really want to play these games? Is that. I did not squeeze you, Google. I didn't mean... Uh, water gun might kill. I'm a high enough level. It did not. I was not going to use water gun. I was going to use mud slap. 
But I honestly feel now that that would have not done enough anyways. Let's see if it will now. There it goes. Okay. Yeah, it's mostly that... <laughs> The reason I was updating my drivers is just because there's one game I have that always yells at me because my drivers are from 2017, and it's like, my GPU is not that old. Like, it's not a crazy old model. Oh, wow, Ivysaur looks way better than Bulbasaur or Venusaur did. Good job, young me. Randomly re paladin things. But yeah, it's a... Uh... <laughs> Okay, I know that, but... Oh, that might kill. That might kill real bad. That kill real bad. Oof. Ow. Did I just lose beef? I I thought I could one-shot. Alright, I'm gonna send in Cinnamon. Who's safer here. Alright. Um... Yeah, there's no items here that would do a heal, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's uh, I think that's the death of a... That might be the death of beef. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm gonna not go and throw beef into a PC box just yet. Uh, and my only reason for doing that is I don't feel like it. <laughs> I'm not gonna drop everything to do it right now. I'll do that once I get out of the out of the tunnel. Uh, just use cut. God, I hate this back sprite. I'm just gonna say that. This this is the worst. This is not Parasect can't do this. <laughs> It's like the worst, the worst case of going off model for a back spray. Because, like, they do it a lot, but not that much. What is your question? Oh! <laughs> That's what Shiitake's doing. Honestly, kinda. Yeah. That's really, that really is how it looks. God, that does not make me like it more. <laughs> it looks like, <laughs> looks like he's like, hey, clam, clam pearl, could you, could you help me out here? Excuse me. So he's like trying to wave someone down, like, hey, you over there? No. Okay. Why does this cave have to be this? Why is why is Shuckle in here? I'm gonna switch to Crumpet. Cause Crumpet has Nightshade. See, like we have back sprites like this, which are really good. Like that is a good back sprite. That looks, that looks real nice. Everything makes sense. Everything looks like it should. Like, of all of the ones for them to go, yeah, we'll just keep the one from Gen 2 and add the, add the new palette. Why did they pick Parasect for that? Because, ah, uh, it's so unappealing. It's like a bad decision. real bad decision. Why does Clam Pearl have to be this? Alright, I don't know if Leech Life can KO right now, but we'll find out. It can, with a crit. Good job, Shidaki. I don't know if this lag spike, if, like, if the lag spikes are random, or if they are related to loading. I think with this, it's we're just getting random ones, but normally we're also getting loading ones. Okay, I'm just seeing if there's any like hidden berry items here. I'm not seeing any, so I'm going to. That's not what I wanted. 
Oh, okay, apparently this is just a house. Never mind. Whoops. Let's go to this one. Let's cut this tree. Well, I guess we're still getting spikes here. I don't know. I guess it's all just as laggy. Hello. What? Ah, they have to be Kanto Pokemon, don't they? That's unfortunate. That's real unfortunate. Well. <laughs> these items aren't useful to me at all. Um. Hmm. 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 Thinking now. So I have... <laughs> I have three Pokemon that were in this Pokedex, which are Paris, Parasect, and Ponyta. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm still going to count that as a, as a death. I was going to say, I'm like, I basically did that cave unnecessarily, but I'm going to count it just because it, it, it makes sense for me to count it as unfortunate as it is. So I'm going to take Beef's item. Ah, Beef was holding an amulet coin. See, I should have done the soft sand. If I did the soft sand, I would have KO'd that, uh, that Ivysaur. Uh, I mean, it basically is. It's, uh... <laughs> it, but it's actually, I think... The real thing is that you throw it, and they think it's your Pokemon allowing you to leave. Either that, or it's, a, like, a Poke toy, and they play with it. But that would confuse me as to why they have both as things. Rest in peace, Beef. You did so good for us. I mean, on the upside, we lost Beef as I loved Beef. You know? And really, what more can you ask for when losing a Pokemon than to have that Pokemon faint in your favorite way it could be? What is this? This is a... And then we need Shop it And then we need Bay leaf And then we need Ponyta Where is it? There it is And then we need to Empty out that last slot Rip There we go Oof, okay <laughs> Alright, well, we'll heal everyone else up. I mean, we still have... We still have a starter on the team. Two starters on the team. Never mind. What am I saying? Yeah, we have two. We had three. We have two. So this will probably, honestly, be a helpful balancing tool to have lost... Uh, to have lost beef when we did. And look at the positives of the situation. I'm actually honestly kind of surprised because I'm looking at this for the first time now since uh, since I played this on like a Game Boy Advance SP. This is the first time I've gotten to like this area playing on a screen this large. And I'm realizing now that what I had thought were indents are actually like bumps upwards in the ground. Because I thought they looked like giant footprints but now I'm realizing that they're just bumpy spots on the ground. Because I was like, oh, they look like footprints, but they're probably just like cave craters. Or something like that. Oh, that's unfortunate. I don't like that. I might honestly just run all the way back to town and, and uh, de-poison shiitake here. Why do you have to be this Ivysaur? I just wanted to, like, get through the cave, and then you had to sh show up and poison me for no no good reason. Okay, we were able to get out that way, and so now we have... We're definitely able to get there. It was mostly that I just didn't want to do wild encounters and have 
the damage over time end up leading to the death of Shiitake. Because that would have been lame. Alright, we're fine. We got this. We got heals. <laughs> we're alive. Oh yeah, I don't know if I finished saying what I was saying earlier, though, about the, uh, about the drivers, but... Uh, one of the games I play, it has a little warning that pops up when your drivers are out of date saying, hey, your drivers are out of date. This could lead to problems in the game. And I'm like, this game isn't in development anymore, so I doubt it will, but I just don't want to keep seeing this annoying red notification at the top of my screen every time I try to log in. <laughs> so, that's why I updated my drivers. Also, because... It's been since 2017, I assumed that there was probably some small stability improvement since then. Even if there wasn't. Alright, get out of here, Sita. I'm a juice ya. That's the power of shiitake. Alright, let's go down here. Yeah, this year I used to think it was like an indent in the ground. And if I, like, kind of blur my vision, I can see that again. But looking at it now, it's using techniques I usually did, or that I usually do in spriting, to uh, just make the, the outline more distinct on certain areas. And I'm like, oh, okay. I see what they're doing. I can now see how this was intended to look. Like that. Well, you try it again, and it didn't work, because you can't do that again. Keep it up. Keep using Fake Out. I want the experience from this to be easy. And he stopped. Well, I mean, there's always next turn. Maybe I'll Fake Out again. I don't like that. Why you gotta do this to me, Haryama? Well, Shiitake doesn't care. So, that's good. Good job, Shiitake. Just take that, like, 1 HP, and uh, we'll carry on. Let's run now. What do we have here? Loudred. It has Astonish. Alright, I'm gonna set up a Poison Powder. Ooh, okay, I'm gonna switch. <laughs> I don't like that I could do that. So I'm gonna switch to Chick because Chickpea is bulkier. Oh, that sounds awful. <laughs> that sounds like a nightmare to try to get that to work. I can How do you forget to, like, sign one of the drivers? <laughs> Wow, that's mm, that's a that's a big bad. I feel like someone may have lost a job over that. Not gonna lie, that is quite the mistake. As, well, as long as it wasn't like a directly automated thing, and there was like a bug in that automated thing, and I doubt anyone lost a job. But still, it's possible. <laughs> Alright, Loudred's gone. Wow, Loudred's actually a threat. That's a surprise. Uh, can we get a C dot, please? I just want free health. And it's a Shackle, which is not that. Alright, well. It's crumpet time. It's weird though, some of the anti-aliasing on these sprites is just random. Like, there's this little bit on the right side of this horn. <laughs> wow. That's... What a, what a what a what a way to have to install a driver. <laughs> oh, I don't like you being here, Typhlosion. No, get out of here. Shiitake doesn't like you. 
Gator Tot, save me. You're my only water type now. <laughs> oh no, I just realized we lost our electric type resistant boy. It makes me sad. Well, oh, Typhlosion has Ember. So, that's not a huge threat, but... It's level 31, and that's kind of a bad thing. So, yeah. What? I got smoke screen. Come on, Gator Tot. Come on, Gator Tot. You can do it. I believe in your ability to not have trouble with a level 31 Typhlosion, who also has Flame Wheel, not just Ember. I don't like that. Kill. Kill with the water gun. <clears throat> so close. Alright. So we're just gonna go with Bite. I'm gonna go with Bite. It's not more accurate, but we're gonna go with it. Regardless. Yes, okay. So that's what replaced Doug Trio, apparently. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't like that there's 31, like level 31 Typhlosions in this cave. Jeez. Alright, well at least it's a Clam Pearl. That's not, that's not nearly as bad. And I can get some life back. Because it's a Clam Pearl and doesn't have much damage. Oh, never mind, it has Whirlpool. That's gonna not be fun. Well, I might as well just use Cut now. <laughs> Why can't I just get the nice, inaccurate Clam Pearls I was getting before? You know? What, what happened to them? You know, they, they were good friends. And, and you know what? What happened to that one C dot I found? That one C dot, he was nice. It's free health. I want free health. And then we got another clam pearl instead. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna do this. Oh. We actually we actually healed off that one. Look at that. Four? Um, obviously yes. Please. Please. Instant sleep. That's so much better. Do I... Poison powder is nice because it gives me damage over time. Stun Spore and Spore are basically going to give me similar effects, but Spore is more sudden, so I'm going to take that. Yes. Spore is one of my favorite moves in all of Pokemon, because it is ridiculous, and I love that. Like, who thought it was a good idea to have a perfect accuracy? I'm just realizing I have to navigate the dark rock rock tunnel or whatever it's called with uh, no flash. Oh, that'll be fun. It sounds like I'm going to need to pull up a map and navigate by that. <sighs> Wonderful. <laughs> Alright, so let's go up here. Right, because this is where I go next. Well, I can't go through here. Never mind. I have to go. Uh, go through this tunnel again. I'll do that. <laughs> Got it. Alright. Let's go up this way. Um, I can now use cut to get into town. I can sell off my useless items that I can't use. Oh my god, I have so much money. Wow, that's, <laughs> that's a lot of money. Alright, well, we'll buy a bunch of Pokeballs. And then we're going to sell our useless items that we can't use. Uh, da, 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 da. I can't use an upgrade because I have to trade to evolve and I can't can't trade. So there's that. Uh, we don't need a Poké Doll because we can't run away. Alright, 
Alright, so let me see. What what Pokemon on this team have no have no held items? Yeah, Gator Tot, Crumpet, and Cinnamon. Okay, do we have any items I can give them? Like it would make sense. I don't think we have charcoal or anything that I could give to that I could give to Ponyta. I have an amulet coin. I will give the amulet coin to Gator Tot. Um, man, I don't really have anything here. Trying to boost the damage of Steel type moves. I didn't know that was a thing. Uh, flying type moves. Don't have any of those. So, yeah. Alright, that's it. <laughs> Got it. Alright. So I'm going to cut through this, and then I'm going to go to the east. Because that's, that's where i got to go. Flash or no flash. All right, we're gonna cut down this tree. Swimmer Mark has a deli bird. It's not a massive threat, but it's still a threat. So, oh good, it used the healing version, but we're just gonna put it to sleep. <laughs> All right, I'll see you, B. Thanks for stopping by. Mm. I don't like that. Oh, come on. Heal me. Mm. Or not. All right, I'm going to take this out. Death. Death, death, death. Cyndaquil, we're not fighting that with this. Alright, goodbye, Cyndaquil. Bell sprout. Oh, switch back. Okay, they can use growth all they want. That's not gonna, not gonna stop me. And it's a dead bell sprout. All right. What was that Carvana? It was Carvana. Yes, Carvana. I uh, will just fight that. I can I can use Leech Life, and that should be a pretty much instant kill. Look at that. Look at that. Done. So the looks of it, if I just go down here, I can't go back. <laughs> so that's going to make this route not fun, I suspect. Though it does help that they had a, a, a Curlia here, which should talk you can just drain the life out of pretty effectively. use Growl a bunch of times, and it's not going to stop me from using Leech Life and taking you out, Curlia. Done. Easy. Not hard. Alright, good job, Shiitake. Keep growing. Lick a tongue. I'm not going to tend in against that. 
Gator Todd has the flinch chance. But Cinnamon also has a flinch chance, because Cinnamon has Stomp. I'm gonna go with Gator Tot, though, because I feel like... I feel like Gator Tot's the least likely to die in this matchup. Boom. Easy. Easy. Alright, I'm gonna go down here, I'm gonna take this item. Solar Beam, alright, cool. Alright, we got another artist defending another item. Alright. Shelter. Did not do much. Alright, and then I'm gonna switch. That's a special attack in this game. Or it's still gonna do much. I'm just gonna Done. Done. Area dose. That's cinnamon. That is hundred percent cinnamon. What? No! It's flash fire. Who, th who said that was a good idea? <laughs> Area Dose is broken. One of its main weaknesses is completely nullified by the ability Flash Fire. Wow, that's terrifying. Okay. <laughs> um, didn't expect to see that, but that's a thing. Alright, you got Bug, he says, but you got Fan Max Feebas, as usual. It seems that the pool of bug type, like early stage bug type replacements, is quite small. Uh, I didn't see what was coming in, but I'm gonna switch to Cinnamon. It's kind of a bad decision, it would seem, but I still have Stomp, so. Done. Okay, there's a berry there. There's a grass patch up here for me to catch things in. That's nice. Uh, I don't want to fight open with this, no. No thank you. No thank you. Pineco. Cinnamon. Also easy for cinnamon. I guess that's, that's what I get. We'll put it to sleep, we'll get another bug type. And it sucks because I don't have a way to go back and heal it, so I'm just going to try and do this. And not hurt it. 
Oh, that was easy. Okay, done. Convenonet. Its eyes act as radar, enabling it to be active in darkness. The eyes can also shoot powerful beams. Jeez, that's kind of terrifying. Alright, Venonet. Uh, if anybody here has a nickname for it, fire away. I'm going to go grab the sprite um, and also think of a potential name that is somehow food-related uh, for Venonet. I don't know how you can get something food-related from that, but... Oh, if there's a will, there's a way. Oh, I just realized I put Rapidash into the wrong folder. I'm just going to delete that from there. And... Right now I can save this as Venonat. PNG. Open it up so I can scale it up. I'm trying to think of a possible name for this thing is uh Give me some troubles, because I got a name idea, but it only works if it's not fully evolved. And that idea is, you know what, I'm going to go with it, because it's the only option I got right now in the rain, and I'm not seeing any in chat, so, Grape. She is the Beninat. Because Grape's asleep, I don't want to send her as the lead. Alright. What's this artist got? Artist Malcolm has an execute. Alright, that's actually really easy for Shut Up. Shiitake. Who's now running kind of low, lower than I would like to be on uh, on moves. I'm actually gonna send a grape here because this is the one one easy opportunity to wake up. I like that little fist. That's <laughs> that's kind of goofy. I did not mean to hit that, but run real fast. Oh wait, grape's awake now. What? What is your ability? Oh! That explains that. Alright, now I'm gonna switch Pokemon. <laughs> to Cinnamon. Shedskin's not a bad ability, at least, so that's good. I would take that over, over a few things. And I can't get poison, so it basically means I'm immune to... Or I can by chance get out of paralysis, sleep, and burns. So that's something. Uh, Clefairy. Gonna send in Grape again, and then switch out again. Alright. Through that double slap. I was gonna do it again anyways, Clefairy. You've changed nothing about my plans. Thank you. Alright. With this. Energy Root. That's a healing item, actually. I haven't had one of those in a while. Alright, so I go down here. I'm not gonna patronize you. I just hopped down a, a cliff and you were here. Hi, Snorunt. Uh, I don't want to fight you with this. Alright, easy. Boom. And... Double boom. Alright. Alright. 
there a Pokemon Center? Okay, wait. First, this is Route 10 where I can go over there. But. Ah! Pokemon Center. Lovely. Lovely. I'm now on Route 10, too, which is nice. Because. I can actually catch something here. In this grass. As long as I don't encounter something already. Um, so I'm actually going to switch to having Grape in the lead. Because Grape is 10 levels behind, which is a lot. It's a lot of levels, but. The plan is to catch her up fast. Alright, we got Sandshrew. I don't really have anyone who's particularly good at fighting a seal. Like, Cinnamon could handle ice moves, but not water. Chickpea's the opposite. Oh, Gator Tot, who can handle both. Boom. Apparently, Seal has Poison Point. That's a thing. I keep forgetting about that. Thank you, Spimmer Mike. Uh, Mike, always looking out for me. There's another berry patch for a hidden item there. Up. A hyper potion. It's also a healing item. Oh. Game's throwing lots of those at us. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's Rock Tunnel. Um which actually isn't too bad of a cave to navigate. I just want rock tunnel map, fire red. Yeah, rock tunnel is comprised of two areas, or of two floors with several areas. I'm going to copy that image, and I'm going to paste it into GIMP. I'm going to paste it into GIMP. Lovely. And then I'm going to just put that somewhere where I can reference it while playing the game. Boom. Okay, so I've seen, I see where I start now. That's the first fight they were telling me about. This might be a very effective strategy. I love how the rich boy is uh, is the one in the cosplay of a Pokemon. I like that. Good, good, good for suit style things are very expensive, so that makes sense to me. Uh, I'm gonna send in chickpea. Oh, good job, Grape. You leveled up. Hopefully you won't be bad soon. Because <laughs> right now you're not very good. Alright. Got Natu. Uh, against Natu, I would say Gator Tot's the best choice. Alright, easy enough. Do I want to run back and heal? I might do that. Oh, dang, there's just Ninjesque. <laughs> Why, hello. Uh, you're here. 
But my team is full, so I'm not going to catch you. I'm sorry, Ninjask. Unless you're shiny, my team is full. Shiny Pokemon are one of the few Pokemon I will actually go out of my way to catch. No matter what. I don't get why there's just, like, a bunch of cut trees there. It's like... It doesn't really... Like, you could just make it faster to get there. That's just, like, an unnecessary way to stop. It's like... I don't... Like, I, I needed that to get here. I'm here now. Why would I need it to just get through this a little bit faster? Like, why would I go... Ah, oh, that's... That's faster to me than... Running around at all. Because it's not. <laughs> it's not faster. It's more hands-off. The lazy man's way through. Another ninja ask. And it missed. Easy. I like how they list it as trainers you don't fight, and I'm like, you mean trainers I'm going to fight, but ones that you wouldn't fight. I, 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 who plans out, like, who plays Pokemon with the initial plan of, I'm going to skip as many trainers as possible, other than someone trying to speedrun? I don't understand. I don't. Makes no sense to me. Unless your plan is to speedrun, you might as well fight every trainer. Good job, creep. Yes! Yes! Learn confusion. Get ready to disable. I don't need that. Yes. This is the first important move for Grape to learn. <laughs> Wait, what? Why is Grape's attack stat higher than special? Is the doing of the naughty nature? I'm confused by that. Ah, that's funny because it learned confusion. <laughs> Alright, well. Alright, I'm getting there. I'm now approaching the ladder. Alright, Grape's able to fight the Weeping Bells in here now, all by herself. Okay, I gotta scoot this. I just have to scoot my map now. So I can see, okay, so I came down here. So I now go down, then over. When I first played the Pokemon Blue, I did not know where to get Flash. Um, it was either that or I didn't have enough Pokemon to get Flash. So what I did is I just navigated this tunnel blind. And if you don't know, in Pokemon Red and Blue, when you don't have Flash, you have no sight. It is just a pitch black screen. And I somehow navigated this entire tunnel completely blind. What was the Pokemon they had? I'm forgetting now. It was Chincha, wasn't it? Yeah, Chincha. Uh, I don't have a good Pokemon to deal with that anymore. Ah. Chickpea can deal with it better than anyone else on the team, I guess. Alright, so that one's done. That That's a fight out of the way. So I run this way. I assume there's an item all the way down here. <laughs> And it's a handy item. Alright, this is actually something I've been hoping to find. 
because I have a plan for it. I'm going to give that to Shiitake instead of the Silk Scarf, and then I'm going to give the Silk Scarf to Cinnamon, who has Stomp. Because, let me see. Let me just do the quick calculation here. Because it's a 20% boost on what I have right now, which is 30, which is a strength 36. So it's still weaker than cut substantially. But it's slightly stronger, which still just means more healing. Alright. Down here in the cave, we've got Golbats. Let's not fight that uh, in this way. Please and thank you. Why has everything got supersonic in here? I don't like that. Alright, so... Yep, okay. I just barely managed to, to turn at the right spot. I'm keeping a close eye on where I am on the on the map. This is a good idea. Chikorita's got Sandstream, as usual. Uh, we're gonna send in Cinnamon. Yay, Grape. Electric. We used to have someone for that. Now we just have, <laughs> like, shiitake and, uh, okay, we have shiitake and, uh, our bay leaf to deal with that right now. I'm just, re I'm realizing that this is in the way, but, yeah, screw it. I'm like, I can't see the chat at all with the, <laughs> the map up. Alright. I don't know why I just did that. Just kind of stumbled around the cave a little bit. Is that Intimidate? Wow, I think that's an ability it actually can have. Interesting. I don't like that. I don't like you paralyzing Shiitake like that. Do I have a... Wait, did I get rid of that? Paralysis? Probably not. No. Okay. Alright, there's a trainer here that they said, Trainers, you don't fight. But I don't care. I'm fighting them. I think it was a Dunsparce? Is that Dunsparce that they said they were sending in? No, it was Drowsy. Okay. That's very, that's very different than Dunsparce. Uh, I'm gonna send a Shiitake. Because of Leech Life. I don't like that Shiitake can be para flinched right now. It's not ideal. Alright, so I go up a little bit. Go over. I can go up against it. There's another trainer. It's just kind of standing in a corner. For no reason. This artist got a Trico. Oh, 25 Trico. Fancy. I'm going to use that as a way to heal Shiitake up. Like so. The other trainer is just guarding a path, I assume. Upgrade. We leveled up again. Alright, we're 
gonna fight this one. Cyndaquil. Alright, that didn't really work, but... Uh, that worked pretty well. <laughs> as Grape goes, that was a good fight. Because as if, if we compare that to all the other fights Grape has been in, that was a good one. Alright, so let's go this way. Oh, I was about to hit the actual ladder. Wow, I did... I managed to navigate that section easily. So we're, we're getting close to done. Getting quite close. Okay, so I went up two, and now I came out here. There's another three trainers here, two of which are skippable. Fight this one. Oh, I see why they skipped this one, because they have four Pokemon. I assume. I assume that's why they, they said to skip. Smoochum. And Eevee. Apparently, it's got intimidate. But I still was able to plow through it. Alright. And I'm actually going to skip these two trainers. And I'm going to come back to them. But I'm skipping these two right now. I don't need poison powder and grape. Yeah, I'm going to skip past them. And that's it's mostly just because... My Pokemon are starting to get to a point where I need to heal them, uh, and I don't want them to be at risk. So I want M3, so I go this way. Up probably takes me to an item. That did not work, so I'm going to switch Pokemon. Things bulky. I, mean, I should have I should have expected it to be bulky. It is a Corsola. All right, so I'm gonna go this way. I'm just gonna ignore the item for now. Ignore the trainer down there for now. Let's put it a Zubat. I don't. I don't trust that it's not going to have wing attack, so against the zoo bat, I'm going to switch. Duskull. I might as well stay in and just use Ember. Ah, oh, crap, they disabled Ember. <laughs> Never mind. That plan has been foiled. I'll do chickpea. Alright, so that's the one of the two essential fights. 
two of the two essential fights. And there's one skippable one up here. Grapes level 21. And it's a Yanma. I'm just going to switch into Sentiment and then use Umber. Alright. I somehow avoided them. It looks like they switch which direction they're looking at. Because it was just standing there for a while, apparently, in their in the spot that they look at you from. Okay. So I'm gonna scoot this way. Okay, and then I go all the way to the wall here. Oh, and apparently Hobo is just in here too. That's wonderful. <laughs> to deal with hobo right now oh cool thank you hobo it didn't want to deal with me right now either okay so go around this then I go this way okay I'm almost out of the cave and once out I can go and heal And this is the last essential fight. Alright. Wingo. <sighs> I'm trying to think of who could fight a Wingo best. Probably Gator Todd. Didn't see what they were sending in, but I'm going to switch to Grape. Chickpea's not in the best shape to fight that, so I'm going to switch to Shiitake. Who, well not in the best shape, is only just paralyzed. Like that. Alright. And now I can run out and heal. I want this item. It's an Everstone. Great. <laughs> Useful item. Alright. Yes. Yes. Okay. Alright. So now I get to go back into the cave and find the people I haven't fought yet. Because I only skipped a few. So I assume there's an item this way. Or not. Apparently there's no item this way, okay. There might be a hidden item that, that way, but nothing that I was able to really access. And that's what matters. Alright. Is there an item this way? Yes. Okay. Good job, creep. 
keep leveling up. Alright, uh... Got trapped in a little hole. Gator top levels up. I was hoping to have found one of the trainers, but instead I found a ninja -esk. But cinnamon levels up too, so that's nice. Everybody's leveling up today. Swine of more like easy for Gator Tot to kill. Diglett. Gonna switch to Shiitake. Gonna switch back to Grape. That's not doing so hot, so I'm gonna switch to Gator Tot. Alright, next trainer. Magnemite. I'm just gonna stand against that. All right. We have a lot of fury swipes that time. back in here where I skipped two trainers and a possible item. Alright. Razor Leaf. Check. Grimer. Sounds like a grape situation, like an actual situation where a grape can be beneficial. Uh, I didn't see what that next one was, so I'm just going to stay in. Uh, Cacnea, and now I'm going to switch <laughs> to Shiitake, who can hit him with that leech life. And hit level 30. Look at her go. She's so good. I ah, Shiitake's good. Oh, we're only an hour in. <laughs> Alright, so... There's possibly an item down here. Two rock smash rocks. Three rock smash rocks. So just one rock smash rocks? Okay. It's not really what I was expecting. Alright. So that's one of the trainers I had to fight. So that means that the other one is now down. Try to hit them with the razor leaf, that worked, okay. So now we go down. Oh, that's what grape's gonna be someday. All right, get rid of 
that. Uh, I'm going to switch to shiitake. Actually, shiitake is not a good choice. I'm going to switch out of <laughs> shiitake. Uh, I'm going to switch to cinnamon. This isn't a trainer at all. This is someone who's teaching me rock slide. I'll take that. Seventy-five ninety. Uh, Gator Todd doesn't really use Leer. Okay. I think that was the last trainer I skipped. It might not be though. That said, oh, I was like, what am I doing? I'm going to organize this. I think uh, I'm good with this cave now. <laughs> I don't know. I don't, there's not really much I need to do left. And I think I fought everyone. I'm probably forgetting someone. And someone's going to like tell me that someday in the comments. Like, yo, you skipped insert number of trainers. And I'll be like, ah, oh, crap. I skipped insert number of trainers. Darn. <laughs> Shucks. Alright. Oh, Rockside good. Gator Tot strong. Alright, let's just... I'm just gonna head out of the cave. Heal everyone up. And call it a stream. Easy. And now I can just kind of blindly fumble my way through the rest of the cave. Because I roughly know this layout. Oh no, they had foresight. They could have hit me if they wanted to. <laughs> Alright, well, too bad they didn't. And I get to a skeppy. I'm not gonna lie, half the reason I'm leaving the cave now is that I just want to stop having to navigate with this map. Oh! There were trainers out here. I didn't think she would be a trainer. <laughs> Crap! <laughs> Did they, they just killed Grape. I didn't think they would have pursuit for some reason, and I, they always do. Wow, that's a shame. Normal type hidden power. Well, Grape helped me through the cave. And will always be remembered for that. Uh, but Grape is dead now. <laughs> so, wow, what a way to end it. We got all the way through this cave with a Pokemon that had just started to be useful. Did I have an item on Grape at all? No, okay. Well, that makes it a little bit easier to do this. Look at that. Gotta love when we get a Pokemon that's useful to us for a little bit and then they die. <laughs> well,. You soaked up experience from everyone else, so I hope you're happy, Grape. That said, the tomb is the tomb's the tomb's filling up. Filling up nicely. Alright, well I'm gonna heal and then I'm gonna see if there's any other trainers out there who wanna fight. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of this because I don't need this map anymore. Alright. Uh, and then I'm gonna switch Shiitake here and Gator Tot. And then I'm gonna go fight trainers on the rest of that route. I had a feeling that was a trainer. Polywag. 
Also easy. Yes, please? Do you want out? Alright. Be nice if Gator Todd would wake up. Be free, Buzz. Be free. Sorry. The last few trainers on this route is this guy. Man, Rock Slide is nice to have. No scary face. No. Ivysaur. I don't like Ivysaurs. They're mean to my team. My team don't like them. <laughs> Good job, Shiitake. This is our time for revenge. Yes. Take that Ivysaur. Take, take the murder that you put upon my baby. Is there really anything? There's really nothing here other than just four random trainers scattered about. Okay. Done. Look at that. <laughs> Gator Tot is good. Gator Tot is very good. So. I think now I'm expected to go into the tower and fight my rival. And then I go from there and I do that whole like side questy thing where I get the self scope and stuff from the self co by helping save them and stuff or whatever I do to get it. So I'm going to save here uh, and I'm going to call that a stream. Did I heal everyone? I did. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to call this a stream. So thank you so much if you joined me live or after the fact. Either way is cool with me, as long as you had some fun. I sure did. Uh, minus the two deaths, one of which that I cared way more about. <laughs> um, that said, I'm going to go to human things as humans do, and you should too. So thank you so much. Goodbye. <gasps>